and just go there and destroy them. But there's always the risk that uh, I could, for example, conquer the city with only one last unit from the attacking forces and then they could attack with many of weak units. This one unit that would be in city and be also the match and the city without any defensive bonuses and they would regain it which mean, would then mean I would lose the game. So I'm not gonna send any units towards them. I'm just gonna wait till they calm down and want to sign peace again. Infantry and riflemen are enough to defend against whatever crap he's got. I don't think the Russians will send any of their units, they have to pass Mongolian territory, although they have a city here, yeah, he's also got Moscow. Right? When you're playing on Viceway, it, it, it usually looks like that towards the end of the game. But then again, I'm not sure if I, if the first goal is possible to get on higher difficulties, because the main difference uh, in difficulty is the research. Research goes down the most when adopting higher difficulties to play, and in this case, I, if I played on higher difficulty, I might have not been able to research calendar and build plantation, the one plantation I needed in time. So I don't think that strategy like that would work on higher difficulties. Maybe on monarchy, but I'm pretty sure it wouldn't work on emperor. On the other hand, on the emperor, the strategy which might work but you will have to be lucky, really lucky then. There is to... If the Chinese had this style already upgraded with silk. If you can remember, they didn't have it upgraded, so it wouldn't work. Then I would only need to build an army and conquer all of these cities without researching Kalenda. Uh, but of course there's always the risk that the Chinese wouldn't research calendar by themselves because in this mod all civilizations uh, when playing on higher difficulties all civilizations have mm, negative modifiers concerning research and that is why it is not possible with some of the nations that have goals that are based on research uh, to play on higher difficulties. Yeah, I haven't tried playing Korea on higher difficulties. Although uh, these are my, this is my opinion based on lots of time I've played the game that it might not be possible to complete that. You could surely complete the other two goals. It would be the first one to discover printing press and survive, but the first goal, I don't think it's possible. Only building units, nothing interesting going on. Are you tired of having wars with me? Not yet. Hmm. Well, when I started talking about higher difficulties, I can also tell you a couple of interesting things which you might not be aware that some of the nations goals are actually easier on higher difficulties and these are the nations that rely on for example surviving against other nations or um, like the in Incan you can take Incans for example they have the goal not allow any settlements in South America and the goal they have two goals like that and they are actually easier on the higher difficulties because 
all of the European nations that usually settle around 15th or 16th century have the research slowed down that much that they are not able to research um, astronomy in time to settle so you don't need to do anything and if you're lucky well, you, you surely will complete the first goal the don't settle in I think it was in, in 1600 because no European nation is able to get to astronomy that quickly on an emperor and with a lot of with a little of luck you can also get the third gold without doing nothing it's probably similar with the native americans they also have goals like that and the aztecs and the weaker nations usually have advantage on higher difficulties you want to give me one of your cities no i don't want that I can build tanks. I'm gonna build some naval units so that I have defense against galleons or frigates which mm, Tokugawa will send and or probably will send and wants to destroy my fishing boats again. Plan for football event. Event. Well, I think you're bored down there in the South Asia. Have some football events. Got laboratories, now go supermarkets. Event. Mongolian Industrial Harris has received a marriage proposal from one of our prominent business tycoons. The Confucian wedding will occur this year. I can send well wishes and a token wedding gift and do nothing. I can send hearty congratulations and a generous wedding gift, pay 29 gold and gain a plus one relations boost with Mongolia or I can announce a national celebration blah 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 pay 118 gold and gain a free re plus free re relations boost with Mongolia which I'm gonna do it's always good to have good relations with your neighbors unless you wanna kill them What do you want? Get lost. I wonder if I will be able to, yeah, go internet, to research all the technologies before completing my goal. I've did that with Japan already. Japanese have the goal to research all completed the tech tech tree I think it's called professionally uh, and I've posted that game it was without commentary I don't know if any of you watched the no watched my games without commentary and I don't know if you have noticed but I've actually completed the goal of Japan the Japanese go uh, exploring the tech tree by 1848 that is the fastest I was able to do it. I actually did it twice 
once when not recording and the other one while recording. So my 1890 and a lot of technologies is not that impressive. But then again, the Japanese start way earlier so that they they can build some of the wonders that help you a lot with the research, just as uh, I was able to build the Oracle and the Great Library. Okay, got another great engineer. He can research robotics, but I'm gonna build the second corporation mining co. This corporation, as far as I know, gives you quite large production bonus. The corporations don't have that much effect here in this mod. They have much larger effects in standard games. And there goes another plague. I don't need to worry about that since I've discovered medicine. 